Welcome to Betty's prestigious property show. Click or call. We do it all. Indoor lighting is a key aspect of any property, contributing to both the functional illumination as well as the design of a room. In simple words, indoor lighting is any lamp, pendant, or fixture used to eliminate your home interiors. They are typically made not just to brighten your space, but to add decor and overall enhance your current furniture setup. This includes the fixtures already installed in your home when you move in, or any lamp or other fixtures you add. Importantly, indoor fixtures are often not waterproof dustproof, so they should only be used inside at all times. What types of interior lights are there? You don't need to be a lighting designer to be able to fully utilize the lighting potential of your rooms. But what you need to know is that there are more light sources in a room than just a central ceiling light. Interior lights for the home include Number one, ceiling spotlights. Spotlights can be used to stage a specific section of a room or in case of multiple bulbs, ceiling spotlights can even illuminate an entire room. General lighting is normally provided by shining ceiling lights. Speaking of permanent, if you need a consistent, reliable foundation for your indoor lighting design, install ceiling fixtures. We don't mean just standard resist ceiling fixtures. We mean chandeliers, pendants that you mount close to your ceiling and even low hanging lights. Without the much needed lighting cornerstone that ceiling lights can provide, your indoor space, whether your room, bedroom or kitchen, might be imperfectly lit. Which rooms are recommended for ceiling lights? The living room, the bedroom, bathroom, and kitchen. Number two, chandelier lights. These lights don't just look great in villas. If you choose the appropriate size, they can be used in any home. Just like hanging lights, they stand as striking pieces of design in a room. Which rooms are recommended for chandelier lights? From the living room to the kitchen to, yes, even the bathroom. There's a place for a chandelier in every room of your home. Number three, down lights. A space saving lighting solution. When distributed well, they provide a good level of brightness for the room in question. Which rooms are recommended for down lights? The bedroom. However, never put a down light over the top of the bed. You are guaranteed a face full of glare regardless of how far you dim it. If you want down lights, position them around the edge of the room over your drawers and dressers so you can see the contents.
Number four, hanging lights. Hanging lights eliminate specific areas. Divide the space and are also great eye catchers thanks to their eye level positioning. Which rooms are recommended for hanging lights? The living room. Number five, pendant lights. Pendants come in a wide range of colors and styles that seamlessly blend into any home decor. You can easily set up pendants by yourself, but having some friends help never hurts. Just attach some sturdy hooks to your ceiling, then run your pendant wire through your hooks along walls and floors while keeping it out of view. Pendants are squancy like their track lighting counterparts, but they can be a lot easier to set up than track lights. So too can another type of indoor light often wrongly seen as challenging to install. Which rooms are recommended for pendant lights? Bedrooms, however, pendant lighting is best with high bedroom ceilings, 10 feet or more, you can use pendant lights as bedside lighting by dropping them down over the nightstands. Just make sure to leave enough space between the nightstand and the bottom of the pendant, at least 12 inches and up to 22 inches. Wall scones. Wall scones extend from your wall to eliminate your halfways and side tables. So you might think that using them requires an electrician installing wiring behind your walls. But this isn't always the case. Plug-in wall scones solve this problem. Just keep the wire well hidden, plug it in, and securely mount your scones. Chances are that nobody other than you will know that you've gone the plug-in route instead of making a more permanent investment. They make a room brighter and also help to stage the room. Which rooms are recommended for wall scones? The bedrooms and the living rooms. and not on dimming. Dimmable lighting is especially important for a good atmosphere, particularly in the living room and bedroom. In addition to dimmable LED bulb, you don't need to install an additional dimmer for these lights. Instead, they come with built-in dimming technology. The dimming process is activated by clock clicking a convectionally light switch. 